We're back tonight with three possible cases of a polio like illness reported right here in Alabama. Tonight we asked CBS 42 State Capitol Bureau reporter Rashad Hudson to speak to doctors to tell us more about the strange disease. It's called acute flaccid myelitis. Doctors say it's a spinal cord injury that's mainly found in children. Acute flaccid myelitis has been in Alabama since 2017, but now new cases have resurfaced. What is acute flaccid myelitis? It's a neurological disorder that presents with acute or sudden weakness in a limb, one or more limbs. Dr. Taylor is the medical officer with the Alabama Department of Public Health. She says this rare illness so far has only been reported in children. Only one per million people will be affected per year, uh, so it's still very rare. Dr. Jane Ness with Children's of Alabama says this is different than other spinal injuries. We see as many cases of spinal cord injury every year at Children's from car accidents, from ATV accidents, bike accidents. The CDC noted an increase in reported cases that began back in 2014, but so far this year, 62 cases across 22 states have been reported. Although AFM is a serious illness, so far no deaths have been reported. Well, most of the patients are hospitalized and based on the treatment of a neurologist, sometimes physical therapy is required. As for what's causing this disease, doctors say at this time, they're really unsure. Reporting in Montgomery, Rashad Hudson, CBS 42 News, local coverage you can count on.